Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I want to thank everyone for subscribing that has subscribed and everybody for uh, watching my channel. So anyhow, today uh, this is what we're working on here. So as you can see, I made a pattern here, right here off of the other side and flipped it and I've got it screwed into here. So that's so I can get the correct pitch here. So I did that with a piece of cardboard earlier, but it just wasn't stiff enough. So I just cut this out of a piece of wood, got it screwed on there, got it looking pretty good. I'm, I'm happy with where it's sitting now. So I think the next thing for me to do is gonna be uh, fill this in with fiberglass here. That way I can start locking this piece onto uh, the rest of the, the part that I built here. That way I can make this all one piece. Um, then once that dries, uh, I should be able to take this board out and then start working on the inside portion uh, behind this. So that's my plan for today. Uh, been pulling a bunch of measurements, uh, you know, from different places from side to side. And uh, this is pretty much what I've come up with here. So I know it still kind of looks crooked, but it's because this cut, whoever cut this is crooked. So it's kind of like an optical illusion. But uh, this front piece right here, uh, once I get to attaching the other pieces that come up underneath, uh, of course, I'll probably have to do a little straightening on this because it's, it's not, you know, super solid. But uh, I'm taking it a piece at a time here. So um, I'm pretty happy with where this is sitting at here. And uh, like I said, I'm going to go ahead and uh, start doing some fiberglass and uh, locking this outer portion together. And... Uh, Hopefully that's going to allow me to start working on the back part. So I'll show you when I get some fiberglass on. I'll be back. All right, guys, uh, before I get to doing the fiberglass, I went ahead and uh, put some metal tape on here. I had to kind of rebuild this uh, little flange right here anyhow. So I just used metal tape to kind of build that out a little bit. You see, when you look at it this way, there's a, a, lit, a lip that goes along through here. So that's what I rebuilt. Uh, then I'll get my fiberglass put on there and uh, get everything locked in together. All right, guys. So uh, I got one coat on. Uh, this is a second coat here before I put the uh, fiberglass resin on. So I'm going to try to uh, hold the phone and do this, which I'm not sure I'm going to be able to do. But... Kind of give you guys an idea. You just got to kind of wet it out. I'm doing this left handed and I am right handed, so kind of odd for me right here, but this is just how I'm doing it. So by doing this, like I said, I'm locking the, the roof onto the side here. So this is going to be its uh, final location. So it's just getting all the body work and getting everything uh, glued together, basically. All right. Now I'm going to have to switch positions here a little bit. Sometimes it's a little rough to get this fiberglass to do what you want it to do, but just keep working on it and it'll usually go where you want it to go. So anyhow, I think you guys kind of get the uh, idea of what I'm going for. So this is all wetted out through here. So I'm going to do the same thing with the rest of it and then I'm going to put another coat on. And then I'll be back. Okay, guys, so I got my third coat on here. So you'll notice there's a big bubble right here. Not too worried about that because it's it's flat right here. There's no bubble here. So whenever it's dry, I'll just cut that off and it'll be good. I have a little bit of working to do up on this seam after it dries. 
but uh, got everything wrapped around there and locked in and uh, should be able to start building uh, off of this once this gets uh, you know secure and dry in here um, so then the next thing I got to do is uh, I got to work on this corner up here just a little bit uh, I may have to reposition this side just a little bit because on the other side it comes out kind of like this there, there's a little bend in it right here uh, I don't know if I can get to the other side but... yeah so if you look right here there's a little bend that goes out so on this side I'm going to cut the panel right here so from here down is going to be gone uh, I'm going to take out what I can on this side but this little part right here is what I need to duplicate uh, on this side so you'll see it, it, you know, it comes up here and it goes out a little bit. So that's probably just going to be a matter of, uh, you know, doing some body work in it uh, when I get to that stage. But uh, starting to move along on it here. Pretty happy to have, uh, you know, have this thing all tied in here now. This is going to make it, uh, uh, you know, bonded together. So I'll be able to start... Uh, doing the rest of my panels and stuff, uh, you know, such as up under here, you know, I'll, I'll start tying everything together there. Uh, like I said in some of the videos here, I've got, I know it's covered, but I got this panel right here, which goes uh, up and down uh, through here, and it's what ties into uh, this portion right here. So... That's where I'm at for today, guys. Uh, okay, guys, so I have removed the front frame from the monocoque here so I can continue on uh, working on the front of it. As you can see, I've got quite a bit up here to do. But what I've got is this panel right here. And this was uh, off of a real event door. So it goes right there, and I'm going to screw it into place, and then it just gives me the two corners, basically, that I have to fill in. So, yeah, that's, that's kind of where I'm going. That's going to be my next thing. And then I'm just going to continue building. So thanks for watching my channel. Uh, I hope you guys like. If you have any questions, comments, or anything like that, uh, please let me know. Thanks, and we'll see you next time. Okay, so I went ahead and screwed this piece on here. That way we can see what we got here. So, it's coming along pretty good. So, when I come up under here, you see just this area right in here is what I got to fix over here now. And then it's the same deal on the other side. So, yep, I'll be filling all this in here next, and we'll get everything tied in. We'll get everything body worked. And, uh, yeah, so that's where we're at. It's starting to come along. Yeah, things all seem to be lining up pretty good. You can see the, the rings right here that I still have to cut out. You can see they line up with the inside here where they come on both sides. So I'm going to have to uh, build the whole firewall on the inside here. I don't have a panel like in front there, but I don't think that's going to be too awful difficult. So yeah, we're coming along. So that's my update for this weekend. I hope you guys like. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, I appreciate it if you do. And we'll see you uh, next week.